after major road closure thanks to the big drive. In just a few days, you'll see a detour in the heart of downtown Orlando. Traffic anchor Amy Biondello shows you what's happening and how you can get around it. Starting next week, it's it's Monday night into Tuesday morning. Technically starts at midnight Monday into 5 a.m. on Tuesday morning. If you rely on I-4 West in downtown Orlando to travel late night into early morning, this coming Monday could bring some big changes to your normal route. We're going to close westbound I-4 lanes in the downtown area, detour all of the westbound traffic off at State Road 50, send them out to the west to Orange Blossom Trail, send them south on OBT back onto I-4. Three westbound on ramps to the interstate will also be blocked. Access from Colonial, Amelia and Huey will be obstructed. The OBT and Gore Street ramps will remain open. The closure is scheduled for one night only, but nonetheless, it will be a major detour for overnight drivers through that window. So it's a five hour complete shutdown of I-4 through downtown Orlando and westbound lanes. Closing the interstate is an important step in order to complete a list of routine repairs and cleanup work. And while it is just one night this time around, more closures will be coming up around the 408 bridges within the next few weeks. We need to widen westbound 408 over I-4. So coming up in August, we'll have some additional closures for that work. All blockages and detours will be clearly marked with about a dozen police officers on scene at every intersection that will be impacted. Also making alternate plans to avoid the highway is encouraged. 429, 417, 1792 are all options. For now, I'll send it back to you. Amy, thanks. And let News 6 help you navigate around the I-4 construction. Head to clickorlando.com slash the big drive for a full tour of all the traffic changes.